Welcome to our channel, where we explore the fascinating journey of human evolution. In this video, we will take you on a captivating journey through time, tracing the origins of our species, Homo sapiens, back to our primate ancestors. Join us as we unravel the story of human evolution. Our journey begins millions of years ago in the dense forests of Africa. Our earliest ancestors were primates, similar to modern-day monkeys and apes. These primates gradually evolved over time, adapting to their changing environment. Around six to seven million years ago, a significant split occurred in the primate family tree. One lineage gave rise to the hominids, a group of primates that would eventually include our direct ancestors. The earliest hominids, such as Australopithecus afarensis, walked upright on two legs, a key characteristic that distinguishes us from other primates. This adaptation allowed them to free their hands for tool use and explore new environments. Before proceeding further in the video, if you are new to this channel, then please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. As time passed, the hominid lineage continued to evolve. Around two million years ago, a new genus called Homo emerged. This genus included species like Homo habilis and Homo erectus, who displayed increased brain size and more sophisticated tool-making abilities. Homo erectus, in particular, was a remarkable species. They were the first hominids to migrate out of Africa, spreading across different parts of the world. Their ability to adapt to diverse environments marked a significant milestone in human evolution. The story of human evolution doesn't end with the emergence of Homo sapiens. Our species continued to evolve culturally, developing complex societies, art and technology. Over thousands of years, Homo sapiens spread across the globe, adapting to various climates and environments. From the frozen tundra of Siberia to the lush rainforests of South America, humans have demonstrated remarkable resilience and adaptability. Today, we stand as the sole surviving species of the Homo genus. Our ability to innovate, communicate, and cooperate has propelled us to the top of the food chain and shaped the world as we know it. Since Homo sapiens separated from its last common ancestor shared with chimpanzees, human evolution is characterized by a number of morphological, developmental, physiological, behavioral, and environmental changes. Environmental, cultural evolution, discovered much later during the Pleistocene, played a significant role in human evolution, observed via human transitions between subsistence systems. The most significant of these adaptations are bipedalism, increased brain size, lengthened ontogeny, gestation and infancy, and decreased sexual dimorphism. The relationship between these changes is the subject of ongoing debate. Other significant morphological changes included the evolution of a power and precision grip, a change first occurring in H. erectus. Anatomically modern human populations continue to evolve as they are affected by both natural selection and genetic drift. Although selection pressure on some traits, such as resistance to smallpox, has decreased in the modern age, humans are still undergoing natural selection for many other traits. Some of these are due to specific environmental pressures, while others are related to lifestyle changes since the development of agriculture 10,000 years ago, urbanization 5,000, and industrialization 250 years ago. It has been argued that human evolution has accelerated since the development of agriculture 10,000 years ago and civilization some 5,000 years ago, resulting, it is claimed, in substantial genetic differences between different current human populations. And more recent research indicates that for some traits, the developments and innovations of human culture have driven a new form of selection that coexists with and in some cases has largely replaced natural selection. 
The evidence on which scientific accounts of human evolution are based comes from many fields of natural science. The main source of knowledge about the evolutionary process has traditionally been the fossil record, but since the development of genetics beginning in the 1970s, DNA analysis has come to occupy a place of comparable importance. The studies of ontogeny, phylogeny, and especially evolutionary developmental biology of both vertebrates and invertebrates offer considerable insight into the evolution of all life, including how humans evolved. The specific study of the origin and life of humans is anthropology, particularly paleoanthropology, which focuses on the study of human prehistory. The story of human evolution is a testament to the incredible journey of life on Earth, from our humble primate beginnings to the complex societies we have built Every step of our evolutionary path has shaped who we are today.